Watch plugins allows us to inject behavior on the JS lifecycle events and also to add some prompt option on the interactive mode. Okay, I'll replace the entire JS config by only the watch plugins config. This specify which plugins we want to attach to our JS. So now let's run it in watch mode and see what happens. Okay, there's nothing uh, because I don't have nothing specified here and also my test is empty. Let me create a okay test. And a not okay test. Okay, one passes, one fails. So let's go to the documentation and implement our custom watch plugin. So first it shows how to use the apply with the jazz hooks and inside the jazz hooks we can attach the should run test suit that depending on the return it will allow the test to be run or not. So let me copy those two. Oh, and also you can use, you can resolve a promise inside of this shoot test run suit. And you can also choose to not use a promise if you don't need the async methods. So I'll use the non promise version. And I, I run only if it is the okay test. Okay, it fails. It is just because the documentation is not updated. So let me open the GitHub. I've already created a pull request for this. And as you can see, this should run test suit. It now receives an object. It now receives an object that in this object includes the test path. So before we continue, let me open the troubleshooting and I will start my Visual Studio code in the buggy mode. So I'll have to use those configs. And to start JS in the bug mode, I'll have to use this command. And I'll add the watch command. And you see that this test path is actually an object with a config duration and the test path.
Actually, I'll deconstruct the object to get just the test path. Okay, now my test path is correct. The not okay does not include this okay test. So it won't run. And now the okay will include and it will run. You can also use the one test run complete that runs at the end of every test run. Okay, it gets called after the test is run and it has this result variable. Okay, and this result variable have all those properties. And I'll make a, a very poor implementation here. I'll just console log the, the failed test, the pass the test actually. So Actually, I'll run outside the bug now. And you can see that you it console log the passive tasks. And there's also a hook that gets called wherever there's a change on the file system. And as as I mentioned here, this test path includes all the test paths that Jets is watching. So let's debug this and see what happens. Okay, that's the first run. I'll just continue. And here I will change the file and you can see that it gets called again. And this project's variable, as it has mentioned on the documentation, has all the test paths that Jest is watching. We can also add or override functionality on the watch menu. So to add a key, we just return the key and the prompt message. So in this case, it will show press S to do something. So let me copy this. And actually I'll comment those jazz hooks. Okay, and here's our new menu. Press S to do something. It won't do anything because the implementation of the run is empty and it will just break the app. So 
So on the run, I'll just console log some message. Okay, still breaks because I'm not returning anything. Okay, when I select S, it just shows the, the console log and because I'm returning false, it won't run the test suite again. But if I return true, let me restart this. So when I return true and I press S, it will rerun all the tests again. With the update config and run, we can also override some configs. So those are the only configs that you can override on the update and run. And for our example, I'll use the test pattern name. So I'll give an option here to run just the OK. So when it prays as prompt, run only the OK test. And in the run implementation, let me remove this. Actually, let's re resolve with false. And I'll pass the test pattern name, test path pattern, actually, test path pattern is one. So I'm starting to watch again. The first run we run all the tests because I'm not filtering anything here. And when I press S, it will only run the OK test and it works. Here it's saying that if you use update config run, you, you must return false on the run, otherwise it will trigger a double run. So let's trigger this double run just to see what happens. So okay, so I'll press S. Well it ran only once. I don't know, maybe on the on the background it, it's running two times, I don't know. You can also pass custom config to the watch plugin. So let me copy this. And you we pass on the Jest config. That's useful if you are using some external library that has some watch plugin. But as you can see, I'm passing the config here, but when I run So this option is only for this custom watch plugin. That's why it must be an array with the path and the object. Okay, but here it's still using the S, the press S to run only the OK test. So this override is not happening because the watch plugin is just receiving this config on the constructor. I think it has here, okay. It is just receiving the config, so I must use this config if I want to override my, my implementation here. So it, re it returns the config, let me start the config. And here on the get usage info, if I have this config, I'll return the config, not, oops, the config, not the default behavior.
OK, press K to show a custom prompt. But if I press K, it will actually run the, the OK test. So let me comment this and run again. Okay, press on the find to and the find, and that's not good. So I think this object is never new. Okay, so that's a fair, that's a problem with my implementation. If this config and this config k, okay. and it also must have a prompt. Okay, so it goes back and runs the default behavior. And you can also use the config to override some other behaviors like the, the test path pattern, I don't know. You can use your imagination to, to set the config. There are some keys that cannot be overwritten, like the Q to key to quit or the C to clear filter pattern. So let's try to override the Q. Okay, that's correct error. Uh, we are tempted to register the K key, but it cannot be overwritten. Perfect. 